So, hi everyone, my name is Raymond Walsh Jr. I'm currently a senior here at Rowan University. Uh, my major is subject matter education and history with a double minor in international studies and um, political science. And I have transferred from Rowan College of South Jersey. I chose Rowan because since transferring from the community college to here with the premier partnership they had um, eight years ago about, um, I decided to come here because it was a nice easy transition but also the education program was fantastic here and just knowing the history that it provides here and everything was really nice to know that this was an education school so it was like something that my dream was always to come here for that so now I'm here so yeah. Favorite wise, like overall throughout here, would have had been my the Nazi Germany class and senior seminar with two different professors, which was Mikhail Dak and Debbie Sar Sharnak. But if we're talking about right now, um, that it would have to be uh, women in American politics and my um, New Jersey politics class with both Dujong and Professor Gorkin. They're both amazing. I've been joining both those classes right now within both my in my minor in poli sci. They're Great professors. I'm learning a lot and it's very interesting to look at the politics of women in our country but also looking through a lens just in the in the state level so it's really interesting so so first um, I am a undergrad office assistant for the SJ um, SJICR um, so that's been fun, it's been interesting, been working really closely with Tara, Roxy, um, Dominique within that division. It's been really nice working there. Um, I currently serve as president of the SIOTA chapter of Phi Alpha Theta, which is the Honor Society for History. Um, I'm currently the Beta Gamma chapter president as well for Delta Alpha Pi, which is the International Honor Society for Students with Disabilities. Um, I am currently the volunteer, a volunteer coach and the treasurer for Rowan Unified Sports here, which is a lot of fun and really enjoyed over the weekends. Um, another thing that I am involved with, I am a committee member for the Center for Neurodiversity um, Student Advisory Council and Accessibility Office Student Advisory as well. I'm currently part of student government as a senator at large at the moment and I am serving as the vice chair and member of the SGA DEI committee. And besides just being really involved in those positions, I am member of the Thai Stigma organization, which is the Honor Society for Transfer Students. Um, I just got inducted into the International Honor Society for Education majors, so that's been fun so far. And Membership-wise, um, again, I got into Shaw, which is the Student History Association, and I got into Anime Club, and those are the things that I'm really involved in at the moment, so. Student History Association, known as Shaw, it is a organization ran, run by students, and it's open to anyone or anyone interested within the history program here. Um, and they have a lot of unique events that are talking about history and that's a lot of fun. I've been to several of them already this semester and last semester as well and it's been really interesting to see how well they've been growing. Um, and for the anime club we meet usually on Tuesdays and Thursdays and we usually discuss um, anime, we watch anime, we do games, we do a lot of variety of things throughout the two times we meet up throughout the week so it's definitely worthwhile going to. Phi Alpha Theta, so that is the History Honor Society. Um, to get in, you would have to have 12 credits within history, and you would need to have a GPA overall for a 3.0, and for your history program one, you have to have a 3.1 GPA to be in, and then after you're done all of them and the credentials are cleared through our advisors, um, you are able to pay a $50 fee to get in for a lifetime, and you are a full-time member of our organization and is really good on resumes, you go to go to conferences, you get scholarship opportunities and everything, and it's, it's really nice to have on campus. For the Beta Gamma chapter, Delta Alpha Pi chapter here on our campus, that is a 
International Honor Society for Students with Disabilities. So it's focused on a different group of people, but it's also um, through the accessibility office on our campus and you have to be registered with them to be in it and you have to have an established GPA as well and have 24 credits as well. We do like discussion nights, we've done movie nights. Um, right now we've been, we just had our general meeting online. We've done some games with people, but we discussed our organization. So hopefully our next meeting, we're gonna have it productive and be in person, so. Well, with the direction that I go, when I'm going in with all of my majors and minors, um, I wanna become a teacher um, at a high school. After that, I'm hopefully able to come back here and go for my MA in special education because I think that's a vital thing and I think that is something that I'm willing to come back for, so. For anyone that's a commuter, transfer students, first year students here, people with disabilities, regardless of your status here on campus, it's just to get involved. Um, be the person that you get to know a lot of people through administration, but most importantly, getting involved, having LinkedIn set up, getting to know a lot of people because you'll make so many connections and it'll be worthwhile. And, and I can definitely tell you that because I've done all that throughout my time in community college and here, and it definitely helped me along the way and learned a lot about this campus, but most importantly, my community college campus as well. So it's definitely worthwhile doing. Thank you so much. Thank you.